Hey people and welcome back to my channel. In this video I will be quickly teaching you uh, how to create the active ragdoll I created for this too. So as you can see this is the ragdoll that I've created and it's following two specific poses at once and I'm gonna teach you how I did it. So first we're gonna be spawning a ragdoll and uh, make him stand up like this and we're gonna firstly importantly very important pose him in the position that we need. I'm going to show you how to do it quickly. So you want to make sure his hands and arms are pointing forward. His knees are bended upwards like this. So this is the pose and it's important to put it somewhat like this. Uh, it is necessary. So once you've done that, you want to get the duplicator out and uh, duplicate the pose so that we uh, can work with it. The next step is to get the weld tool out. And we're gonna put uh, the right foot to the left hand, the left foot to the right hand, and then we're gonna have the legs to legs, legs to legs. Right. The next step is the muscle tool, which is also in a very important one. So by default, it should look like this. What you wanna do is put the expansion to a thousand. That's the limit, and make sure it's on start on, and be sure that the width is to zero. Once you've done that, what you want to do is get the hand to the upper arm, hand to the upper arm, just like that. The next step is to get the rope tool out. And the rope tool uh, is this, and you want to make sure that by default it should look like this. Uh, if it's not default, just put it like this. And uh, you want to make sure the width is to zero. Next, the rope tool uh, is for the hands to the head, hands to the head. Pretty much that's all you gotta do. Now let's get the duplicator out, which is necessary. Duplicate it, put it back there, and then freeze it. So let me just put him next to it. This is how you create the uh, ragdoll uh, from uh, the video. It's pretty easy once you know how to work with it. For some, it can be a bit complicated, but I'm sure you work out. Uh, if it's too complicated for you, you can always use the muscle tool instead and just poke around with it with the settings in order to create an active ragdoll. This is just how I created the ragdoll specifically, so uh, I hope this tutorial helps you. I hope you learned something new. And don't forget, uh, if you press numpad 0, you'll freeze the uh, ragdoll in position. I don't know why you want to do that, but if you press numpad 0 again, you can reset the ragdoll. That's it. Thank you for watching.